All right, so that's a good question. Let's, let's say that um, you're trying to make a decision about um, where to put your time and energy as an entrepreneur. So, for example, you've got choices about whether you can approach things from a smaller, more grassroots level or if you can work from a grander scheme. So, my suggestion is always look at your end goal and put your plan together that meets the larger goal in your life and dream big. Remembering if you can only dream big, it's going to allow you to get there. The more time and energy you have to employ that strategy, the better. Um, with some caveats, it's just don't waste your time. But you, 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 what I would encourage you to look at is try to imagine that for right now, um, if we have, this is your level of experience and the value you bring to whatever enterprise you're doing, and if this is time, that where you are today is right now you you've got maybe let's, let's just call it 10 years 10 or, or more years into the career you've established expertise education um, experiences contacts everything that is your some set of your assets that you've used well so experience and value right now if we're talking if this is today Try to imagine that you, let's just say you're about halfway. And this is expandable as far as we need to go. But over time, you're saying, where should I put my time and energy to get the greatest value? Just realize that this is going to be an arc at some degree going up. And the only, let's just say that this is your goal right here, whatever that might be. That your decisions along the way can't always know where you're going to be right here because you haven't experienced the time and had the experiences to let you know where you're going. But what you do know is you take one step and you do one thing. That one thing allows you to experience yourself, build yet one more piece of experience that allows you to make the next decision, which is lies in here. So we can't know what's beyond step one. We can only imagine it. So when you're doing your planning, think of it this way. Um, I've got, I know who I am. I'm looking at goals that, that express the vision of what I see in my life. I can take one step at a time. And then I've got to allow some intuition to happen that allows me to see what are the new possibilities and where I go next. So your plan's got to have that flexibility to it where you're going to, um, kind of move step at a time it allows synchronicity to start playing with it and it does it's just I can't know I again I just cannot know exactly every step it's going to take to be here on my trajectory so what I encourage someone who's an entrepreneur that is trying to figure out where their strength is and where their niche is in life is that you have to start building experience along the way and as you go this plan will start to move, but you'll still be heading in the right direction.